After installation of the program, we can now start authorization box. The first time, we have to log in with the user default admin. We can now enter the license information. Click on update license and enter the license name. Be sure to enter the name exactly as displayed in the order form. Select the location of the provided license file and click on the button save. Next, we have to create a connection to a Dynamics NFV database. Click in the section database connection on the button add and enter the credentials. Make sure to give the connection a recognizable name for the users. Finally, we have to assign the available roles to the user, in this case, user default admin. Go to the menu item settings and open access management. Open the user and click on the button edit roles. Click on all to write. Optionally, you can enter and set up more users if you have a license for two or more users. After this, the authorization box is ready for use. Click on the logo of authorization box to go to the dashboard and change the password for user default admin.